I guess you don't want to come with me today, huh? Yes, I'm actually going to take a nap. Yeah, you've been busy around the apartment uh, today. You guys, everything over here is in storage bins. All right, cool. Uh, I'm going to go down. Of course, they probably already seen it live, but we are testing this out, but I've already seen it live. Uh, if I do go live, uh, you're going to monitor over here real quick? Yes. Okay, or take a nap. I'll do both. You do both, okay. Well, a lot of people take a nap on our videos anyway, so uh, let's head down. I'm going to head down to the riverfront. That's probably a good place to test uh, any test, any new equipment that we get. We always take it down to the river to test it, right? Yes. Okay, we're on the riverfront uh, up here. Enjoying a nice view of the lighthouse right here. View of the Mississippi River in the background. Enjoying uh, this. And I'm not over there, over by the bench, because uh, there was a photo shoot going on. I'm afraid I may be in the background, so out of respect, I uh, decided to come here instead. This is my alternate location where I like to sit on the riverfront, staring at this uh, lighthouse right here. Just gotta aim the camera a little bit better because the sun is almost. If I aim it from the, if I aim it from over here. You guys get the sun more, so I'll just aim it this way instead. Uh, yeah. Um, nice day to be up in the riverfront. You've probably already seen the test stream on this already. Um, whatever I put up, I will put it in the iCard. In the upper uh, right-hand corner of your screen, you should see that iCard pop out up there, what I usually do. Uh, it's from past week's, uh, last week's video, then at the end is the last video that you saw two weeks ago. That's usually I do the, uh, iCards here on the channel. Uh, just a nice gorgeous day up here. It was clear earlier today, but got partly cloudy, which is not bad. We'll take this. And I'm going to be investing, uh, some big items coming up, uh, for the channel. Uh, we're going to be investing into a uh, new camera eventually uh, just pricing one right now and I'm going to find one is like and I also find out that I can put those little wind muffs on this uh, thing so if we still use this camera I'll get the wind muffs on this thing so it blocks the wind but not the voice which you guys been complaining about a lot lately on the videos how windy it is that's why it was very selective coming out here is because of the wind uh then i'm missing some good decent walks uh in uh for walking videos but i will invest into a couple of like um it's a stick on uh wind muffs uh like dead cats like little mini dead cats you put in on your over your speakers and i saw just some of them just the other day on Amazon, I should have grabbed some when I got the chance. When I, especially when I ordered this thing. Uh, that's why I should have grabbed some. Okay, we're going to tilt over this way and just kind of do one more clip here. We'll head down to the fountain. We'll finish it there. Because if you saw the live stream, that's why I started it. Uh, with the live stream. Okay, so uh, we'll just do one more clip here. And uh, we'll finish it at the fountain. Just kind of saw that flying by, so I probably better get it real quick. Uh, this is one reason why I hate this camera lately. It just doesn't want to zoom in, and if it zooms in too fast, it blurs. But yeah, that's one of the pelicans that just flew by me. Well, like I said, uh, just a nice day up here, uh, out there. River is up from the heavy rains we had recently. When I do get the new camera, I probably will not be zooming in as much, in and out as much, uh, with, uh, the camera there. That's what I'll try to get right there. Everybody knows what that is, right there with the American flag. Yep, everybody knows what that is, and that, so... Yep, we're just going to do one more clip. We're going to go down to the fountain. Uh, then uh, uh, then you probably saw where I started at on last week's uh, live stream. Uh, it's testing this uh, thing out to see how it works. 
and uh, I'm gonna just do a, a nice lengthy test uh, to see what my range is for the other one that's all I was trying to do an attempt to do because we're gonna need to know uh, more information on that thing uh, before I uh, Vegas vacation which is gonna be up here really quick it's kind of funny you watch this almost in mid August and we still have not booked our vacation yet and I mean I better start going I better start booking now uh, to get the best rates but I'm still waiting for that one letter from the Alcatraz um, hope I get it soon oh just let you guys know time you watch this video the summer playhouse season has ended for the showboat but I'm, as I'm filming this, it's only got a few more days to go. Then the, by the time you guys are watching this, the summer play season is over. Like I said, I'm going down here to the fountain behind those trees. And we'll wrap up this video. Even though it's only 77 degrees, it's still a little humid out there somewhat. It feels like about maybe like 84 degrees, but still not bad. But what a way to end this video. Uh, we're going to be looking at this to end this video right here. Uh, yeah, the water is still crystal clear. We're here in the uh, early part of August. By the time you watch this video, it'll be mid-August already. Uh, kids will be going back to school here shortly in the state of Iowa. I think they go back in uh, August uh, 23rd uh, because they don't want them to go... Because a lot of schools are already, time you watch this video, a lot of schools has already started. And it's not fair that they're missing out on the, the local state fairs and all that stuff. But some places already had their state fairs already. Iowa will be just at the start of their state fair run, uh, basically, when you time you watch this video. Uh, one of the biggest state fairs in the, in the country, Iowa State Fair, behind Texas State Fair and a few other state fairs. They say hi. For some reason, Iowa makes the news a lot because of the uh, because of the uh, PETA people uh, always protesting about the uh, butter cow that Iowa always has. They always want to destroy and vandalize the butter cow. Uh, yeah, that's not how you do a peaceful protest by destroying something. It really destroys what you are all about, basically. Yeah, it's called. Uh, <laughs> Uh, has something to do with better treatment of animals, uh, basically. I don't know. To me, animals are tasty. If you really want to eat one. <laughs> uh, yeah. There goes a few more subscribers who are vegetarians or vegans or whatever. That's your choice. That's congratulations to you guys. Uh, just don't criticize how we eat on our meals. <laughs> nah, so. It's tick for tack, they say. Well, it is not for tick for tack. It's time to end this video. It's very relaxing here at the fountain. Um, I will put that. This is where I test, started my test stream here. But this is how I'm going to end the edited video here. Please like, share, subscribe, don't forget to subscribe button, notification bell. Uh, we'll see Angie tomorrow. Don't know what kind of video we're going to do because we're going to be really busy off camera tomorrow. But uh, we'll see what happens on camera. All right, we'll see you guys tomorrow.